What's good, y'all? It's the Duma Shots React, and we're back with another video. Who we got today, see? Today we're back with another American reaction. Super excited about this video. If you're new to us and, and we're new, new to you, you, make sure you scroll down, hit, hit that subscribe, subscribe button, button, and turn on the post notification bell because we're, we're on the road, road to 200K. 200K. And we cannot get there without you guys, all right? Join the family. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's blessing again. Have you missed me? Because I always miss you. I'm always thinking about you, okay? If you haven't subscribed to the channel, you already know what to do. We're all grown here. I'm grown, you're grown. You know you need to click the subscribe button, okay? So let's get into the video. As you can tell from the title, today is something a little bit new on my channel. I'm going to be teaching you guys Yoruba, okay? And it's going to be a new series, and we're not just going to quickly, like, gloss over it. It's not going to be a quick thing where, you know, we're going to just learn Yoruba. I'm going to really get deep into it. I'm going to dig. We're going to get to the bottom of the... The bottom, you know? <laughs> I'm going to teach you everything, the alphabet, numbers, um, talking about religion, body parts, insults, romantic sayings, whatever you can say in English, you're going to be able to say in Yoruba by the end of this series, I promise you. Probably wondering, okay, so experience will only like, what kind of experience do you have in Yoruba? You'll find out in it. <laughs> okay, so today we're going to be learning about greetings and we're going to learn how to what, what you say when you first meet someone. And the first thing people always ask me when they want to speak Yoruba or when they hear I speak Yoruba is, How do you say hello? Like, what's hello? But the thing is, there's actually no direct translation for hello in Yoruba. Like, it's not a word that we have that directly translates to hi or hello. But I'm going to teach you everything else around it so other ways that you can greet people when you first see them the one thing i always hear every non yoruba person say is kilo shale like oh my gosh that that phrase is so rinsed kilo shale but actually that is a way that you can say hi so the first word i'm going to teach you today is kilo shale i'm going to write it phonetically across the screen not just how it's spelled but how you pronounce it Kilon Shele. Kilon Shele. And Kilon Shele just means okay. what's up, what's happening, what's popping, like, or what's... So wait, y'all y'all don't have hello? It's what's happening. So uh -huh. that's like us saying, what's good, y'all? Yeah. Okay, so... What's happening? Kilon like Shele. Kilon Shele. Y'all. Kilon Shele, y'all. Kilon Shele, y'all. <laughs> Kilon Shele, y'all. I don't know why I gotta do that. You feeling it, though? Like, <laughs> Kilon Shele. Kilon Shele. Yeah. I feel like, I like Long that. Chili. What's going on? So, I'm going to say it slowly and I want you to repeat it after me. Ki lon shele. But I think like a more, a more normal way that you would say what's going on is ba wo ni. Ba wo ni. Ba wo ni. And that just means how are things? How are you? Like, oh, Sandra, ba wo ni. Oh. Kenny, Bauer. I'm just saying my friend's name, sorry guys. <laughs> but um, yeah, you just be like, Bawani, like how are things, Bawani. how are you, Bawani. kind of thing. Another way to say, are you good, is Showa da da. She owa da da. That means, are you good? So da da means good. She o wa da da. So you know, it's like, it's like saying, like, you good, yeah? Showa da da, yeah? And so if you meet someone you haven't seen, Showa dad. Oh, dada. Showa dada. Yeah, showa dada. Showa dada. Oh wait, hold on. I like to say, I'll I say, like are you side. good? Are you good? Like, that's a way you can say it too. You know what I'm saying? Like, are you good? As like, is everything okay? You look like you in distress. Are you good? Showa dada. dada. But like, but you know, when we say, are you good? Is off that. Showa dada. Yeah, it's like, yeah, I'm straight, but like, what's your issue? Showa dada. <laughs> I'm straight. What's your issue? I don't know nothing else yet. <laughs> oh, okay. Kilo she kilo she kilo shele kilo shele yeah kilo shele kilo shele show da 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 show wa da da show wa da da kilo shele show wa da da kilo shele kilo shele no baby, not like that. Oh, <laughs> Just, <wait. laughs> she said, hats off here. <laughs> Been in a while, be like, show a da da, yeah. Show a wa da da, yeah. 
Okay, Jelly. Okay, so in Pigeon, y'all taught us the O. So, but but they're saying yeah. Yeah. Showa da da yeah. Showa da da kilo shile. What? You just you just add words. I feel like oh kilo shile kilo shile. Kilo shile. Kilo shile. Kilo shile. I like the song. Yeah, yeah. They y'all let me know. Is it rinsed? That's the term she used. Is it rinsed? Is kilo shile rinsed? Like it's really not one that y'all go for to oh. greet somebody with? Or do you guys prefer shelo dada? She wo. She wo dada. W o. Oh dang it, I forgot. She lo. Okay, y'all know what we do from the top. <laughs> Uh, you know, it's like, it's like saying like, sure. you good, yeah? Sure, what I yeah? Sure, what I yeah, yeah. yeah. Sure, if you meet someone, pronouncing it wrong. Yeah, sure, what I Or do y'all prefer more sure, what I Like, as a greeting to, you know, say hello to a person. You good? Oh. oh. Sure, what I The energy, Sierra. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen in a while. Be like, sure, what I da, yeah? Say, yeah, what I da, yeah? Ope, Joan, yeah? My boy, I see who yeah. If you know, you know. But anyway, the point is, sure, what that that is another way you can say how are you, are you good. So when you first see, when you see your friend haven't seen in a while, you can be like kilo nshele. You can say bawoni, or you can say sure wa da da. So those are the three kind of ways that you would say how are you when you first see someone. Okay. The next thing I'm going to teach you is how you say good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. First thing you need to know about Yoruba language is that we are very respectful. So when you're talking to adults and when you're talking to children, is there's, there's just a slight difference, and that's e and o. So if you're talking to someone who's your age or someone younger than you, you would say o. When you're talking to someone older than you, you would say e. So I'm going to teach you all of them with the older person's... Um, prefix in front of them, but I'll teach you how you can swap it out for someone who's your age or younger than oh. you. So the first yeah. one is e ka ro, e ka ro, and that means good morning. Aro is morning, so e ka ro is good morning. So practice it. E ka. E ka. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Okay. Good afternoon is e ka son. O son is afternoon, so good afternoon is e ka son. A e evening e is e ka le. E ka a le is night time, so you will say e okay. ka le. I'm gonna go through it one more time. E, e ka ro, good morning. E, e ka so, good afternoon. E, e ka le, good evening. If you're talking to someone who's your age, the end is silent. I mean, you can hit it, but it's oh, not yes. gonna be like the e ka son. 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 Yeah. How like, we it's, say things. It's very, it's very subtle. Yeah, it's yeah. how we say things. Yeah. Okay, so e ka ro, e ka ro, e ka son, e ka le. Yeah, I'm liking Yoruba. Yoruba is definitely sounding promising. Yes, I'm liking it. You don't want to say e for them. You'd be like ka ro, ka son, ka le. That that that's like your age mate. Um, but. You just, the air remains the same. You either say ka ro, ka son, or ka le, and you just, you just switch out. Very, very, very simple. It's a simple something. Okay, quick test. Watch on the middle. Comment down below how you say what's happening. Five points if you get it correctly in the comment section. What's happening? Sh uh, sha dada. Sha uh, dada. Ba, ba wo na. Ba wo nani. Ba wo na. Ba wo ni. Ba wo ni. And, um... Kilo chalet. Kilo chalet. Oh, baby. You got it. Kilo chalet. You got yeah. it. You got it because it, it would have took me a little bit to rethink. No, nah, we got, got it. it. The energy is there for you. Oh, you, okay, you yeah, because we it. won, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah 100%. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, yeah. We, we got we to gotta get this together. We got to get a handshake, y'all. As y'all can together. see, we got to get that little we handshake here. And don't cheat. Let me know down below how you say what's happening, if you still remember. If you're coming from outside and you're coming in, what you will say to the person at home is e kule. If they're younger than you, you'll say kule. It just means like ile is house. If you're at home and someone comes in, you say to them e kabo. So e kule is what you say to the person that you meet at home. E kabo is what you say to the person who's coming in from outside. But if your if your husband comes home, your children comes home, I don't know, anybody comes home, a car bowl, and I, I, we like to say O. Oh. So if you want to sound Yoruba, put O oh at the end of everything. <laughs> okay. 
we, we like like random ad libs. But yeah, so when when someone comes in, you say e ka bo, and when you when you come in, you say e kule. So the next one is oda ro, which means directly translates to till the morning. But it's how you say I'll see you tomorrow. So if if you were if this is what you would say in the workplace, if you want to say I'm going to see you tomorrow to your colleagues, you'd be like oda ro, oda ro. Da roll till the morning. If you want to say goodbye, you would say oh da bo till we meet again is what it directly translates to. But you would just say oh da bo. That's goodbye. So anytime you're leaving anyone, oh da bo. That's it. If you're gonna see them tomorrow, but it might not be in the morning, you can say oh dollar, oh dollar, oh dollar till tomorrow. Those are the three ways you will say goodbye to someone. And another way to say it's been a while since I last saw you is Otojo Meta. Directly translated, that means it's been three days, but you just say it for any. It's, if, it, if it's been a while since you saw the person, you'll say Otojo Meta. Otojo Meta. It's been a while. Where you been, basically? Yes, I think I'm going to write Otojo Meta. What? Otojo Meta. Meta? You gotta rewind. I thought it was all tied Joe Bro. Oh, it? the me. All tied Joe Meta. All tied Joe Meta. Yeah, all tied Joe. Shawa Dada. Show. <laughs> it's show. It's Wait a show. minute. It's oh. been a while. What's happening? Yeah, yeah. All tied Joe. Hold on, wait. All tied Joe Meta. Shower dada. Shower dada. Sierra just coming with Shower the dada. <laughs> feistiness. Shower dada. Woo, spicy. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Gumbo. Gumbo. <laughs> You just say it for any. It's, if, it, if it's been a while since you saw the person, you'll say, Oh, to Jometa. Oh, to Jometa. It's been a while. Where you been, basically? You killed it. Oh, to Jometa. Shower dada. Oh, to Jometa. How you hit it? Baby, hit it. Ota jo meta. Ota jo meta. Shawa. Shawa. It's awesome. Is it sha I want to say showo so I'm bad. A, I'm, I'm, I'm a, I think it's shawa. Shawa, yes. S. Okay. Shawa la. Shawa. Okay. Ota jo meta. Shawa. Dada. You say sha? Baweta. What? Oh, Baweta. Baweta. I'm going to say Baweta. Bawani. Bawani. A uh, kilo chalet. Okay, I'm gonna say kilo chalet. I don't know why that one sound more like right there, like yeah. Kilo in the pocket. I can I can say that one more. Oh, oh, ta jo meta kilo in kilo chalet. Kilo in chalet. I thought it was kilo chalet. Kilo chalet. Kilo chalet. Oh, ta jo meta kilo chalet. What is it? Kilo chalet. I gotta get this part. Ota jo meta kilo chalet o. See, I gotta, I gotta get the sass. You know, like. Oh, you got the sass. <laughs> Trust me, you got the sass. You've been sassy this whole because, video. You know how when we had um, people in our class who spoke a different language from us, mm -hmm. and it will be people who's like, "How do you say, you know, profanity words in your language?" That's the first thing you want to know too. I want to know the sass. There you okay, go. Okay, I, I, I want to know the size. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um... Yes, I think I'm going to wrap it up there. I don't want it to be too long. I want the episodes to be quite short. I want them to be quite like punchy, so you just you just you just grab what you need to know and you keep moving. At the end of every episode, I'm going to be giving you a test, and you cannot cheat. If you cheat, I'm watching you guys. So your test for this episode is to tell me how you would say to someone, "Good morning, how are you?" Good morning, how are you? So how do you? Good morning is Oda. It's, it's one of the E's. Ikule. Is it? I think Odale. No, I think that's good evening. Eh, no. Uh, I think it's, it's Odale. E. I think it's Odale. I don't think it's I'm saying It's E. It. The Sean, the song was the middle one. So that was the good afternoon. 
What, what was, was it? Good beginning? morning. Oh yeah, good morning. I just remember kind of like the last two, just about. Yeah. She hit, hit us with the last greeting phrase for that one, and I kind of. Okay, I so I'm gonna say, I'm gonna one. say the good afternoon one. All right. Yeah. I forgot. I think we're close. We got a replay. One of those. Mm. Let's see what it is. And how are you? It is. Wasn't we just saying that back to back? I think so. Oh man. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> How are you? Uh, yeah, I think I think that's what it is. So we got that part down. The, the greetings of how are you? Uh, where you been? What's happening? I think we got that one down, Pat. I want you to I want you to write in Yoruba, "Good morning, how are you?" And if you get it right, that's ten points. Obviously, I can't really give you nothing in it because <laughs> it's free on the like screen. But, this, but okay. just know if you got it right, you're a real one, and your future is gonna be bright. If you get it wrong, your future. Oh, we're gonna hit. Right, if, if you get it right, your future's gonna be bright. Yes, yeah, let's just keep, keep it there. <laughs> yeah. Hey, killed it. Yeah, she did a really good job. Y'all check our channel out, man. Yeah. Um, other than that, I feel like your robot does definitely sits with us a lot easier. The memory was there, as y'all can see, who was yeah. on it. Like, it wasn't hard. It, it wasn't, wasn't hard. And also, it wasn't a lot that we had to jam in. Right. Right. You know, this reminds me of Twee. Mm. You know, because a lot of our people here speak Twee. Mm. Our family just didn't pass down the languages, so we we speak nah. English and A A V E, you know, yeah. and a whole lot of sass. Yeah, well, other than that, that yeah, other than that, I think it was dope. <laughs> I think it was dope. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. We hope you guys enjoyed this video with us. Like this video, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We have enabled our super, super thanks. thanks if you like support the channel that way, as well as our reaction request form is in our description, description box below. below. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.